and good morning. Welcome to our European Morning Call. And uh, just uh, catching up on the markets on Monday morning. And uh, well, we've got the dollar index open here and uh, just doing a bit of a bounce there off the lows, but it's made new lows uh, overnight. Uh, touching uh, its weakest since uh, that 15th of July uh, level. So um, pushing lower um, on the dollar, um, all eyes on the European um, on the European leaders in Brussels, their talks are going into fourth day. They're still trying to hammer out this rescue package. The Frugal Four become the Frugal Five with Finland um, uh, joining the Netherlands, Denmark, uh, Austria, um, and uh, and uh, the uh, what's the first? Sweden is the other country. Sorry, um, and uh, well, we've got uh, the euro is pushed up, uh, pushed up on hopes for a deal, but uh, it's come back down this morning, having failed to secure that deal. But uh, I think with the dollar being offered, um, uh, we've seen uh, moves in cable too. So uh, cable bouncing around this sort of region here. Um, pretty well trapped in this range. So look to see whether or not uh, it can hold. Uh, th this range here really is a, is a nice little uh, 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 area to, to look at. Um, you see the general downtrend being made here, um, a series of lows all around this sort of region here, around 125.10 sort of region, 125 region here. Keeps hitting that support, um, but we are making sort of lower highs on each rebound. European equity is a bit lower this morning. Um, look out for AstraZeneca due to report uh, outcome of phase one trial of its candidate vaccine uh, for the novel coronavirus. Um, you can follow everything here on forexlive.com uh, on our platform. Um, you can find uh, any kind of news and updates there along with, of course, on financial news uh, from Dow Jones. Uh, that's it for me for the moment. Uh, we'll have more uh, for you later on, but um, uh, just a quick final update again. European markets are just a touch weaker this morning um, after, uh, well, really, as we're looking at this EU summit, if we look at the FTSE 100 here, but we are very much in this sort of region here. We're not seeing big, big moves yet. Uh, and I think really you're going to be looking at the, um, the the vaccine to the news this week is potentially being a driver for the market. So uh, earnings as well coming up this week, lots happening, but uh, we'll have more updates for you all week. So do stay with us here on x -Ray. Thank <laughs> you.